In this short video, I would like to demonstrate one approach to performing polyrhythmic ratios. And we're going to be using some of the concepts from Carnatic theory, including some of the rhythmic syllables. Now the first thing we want to do is we want to equally subdivide the beat. This concept is called gati. A gati is a different equal subdivision of the beat, and our beat is going to be defined by one quarter note in this example, although it can be defined as a half note or a whole note. We're going to be using a quarter note and our beat will also be defined by the metronome. So the first gati is known as tisra. Tisra is a triplet. So we are going to make a, an eighth note triplet and we are going to be using the syllables ta, ki, te. Takita, 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 ta. Okay, the next one is called Chatusra. This is the four tuplet for sixteenth notes. And we are going to be using the syllables ta, ke, di, mi. Takadimi, 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 ta. The five tuplet is known as Kanda. And we are going to draw five sixteenth notes with a five on top. Five on top means that you can fit five sixteenth notes in the space of four sixteenth notes. And the syllables we will be using are ta, ke, gi, na, tum. Ta, ke, gi, na, tum, ta, ke, gi, na, tum, ta. Next one, the sixth tuplet is uh, going to be the triplet times two, so we're going to call it Tisra second speed. Tisra second speed. Three, four, five, six. The six on top. Now there's many ways to add up to six, like three plus three, or four plus two, or two plus four. Right now we're going to use the three plus three uh, syllables. So we're going to take our uh, takite and we'll just Repeat it once. Ta ki te, ta ki te. So we have the pattern ta ki te, ta ki te, ta ki te, ta ki te, ta. And the next prime number and the last gati we will go over right now is called misra. Misra, which is a seven tuplet. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now, if I put a seven on top, that means seven in the space of four. So sometimes you'll see it written like this, but just a seven will do. Now, there are also many ways to add up to seven, like four plus three, three plus four, five plus two, two plus five, etc. We're going to be using the four plus three pattern. So we can use our four plus three, takadimi takite. So I'll write that out. Ta. D, mi, ta, ki, ta. Taka di mi, ta ki, ta, ta ki di mi, ta ki, ta, ta. Okay, so these are the these are the few gatis we are going to be using, and it's a good practice to be able to switch back and forth between each gati using a metronome. So say I wanted to go back and forth between tisra and chatusra. Ta ki te ta ki te ta ke di mi ta ke di mi ta ki te ta ki te ta ke di mi ta ke di mi ta. Okay, well, let's see if we want to go back from a four tuplet to a five tuplet. Ta ke di mi ta ke di mi ta ke gi na tan ta ke gi na tan ta ke di mi ta ke di mi ta ke gi na tan ta ke gi na tan ta. Okay. It's also good practice to be able to switch back and forth between any of these combinations. I'm going to demonstrate one pattern going from slowest to fastest and back to slowest. Ta ki te ta ki te ta ke di mi ta ke di mi ta ke gi na tan ta ke gi na tan ta ki te ta ki te ta ki te ta ki te ta ke di mi ta ki te ta ke di mi ta ki te ta ki te ta ki te ta ki te Take gina tum take gina tum take dimi take dimi taki te taki te ta. Okay, so gati are our equal subdivisions of the beat. Now, 
to create these polyrhythmic ratios, we're going to be using one more concept called Jati. J-A-T-H-I. And the Jati are equal sub, well, let's say Jati are, are regular accents over the Gati. Regular accents over the Gati. So what does that mean? Okay, let's say we want to perform a three against four, three to four ratio. We are going to start off with the triplet, which is known as Tisra, and then we are going to apply Jati four. So we have Tisra, Jati four. So what we are going to do is we are going to set the speed of a triplet and, and we're, we're going to do that four times just to set up the speed. Ta, ki, te. And then we are going to replace the three syllable group with the four syllable group. Ta, ke, di, me. And if we do that, it will look something like this. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. We are, what we're going to do is we're going to accent every four. One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four so that we have one, two, three equally spaced accents against one, two, three, four equally spaced metronome clicks. Three times four is 12, and then we achieve an entire cycle. So what I'm going to do to demonstrate is set the speed with a triplet first, and then I'm gonna do that four times, and then I'm going to replace the three syllables with the four syllables. Ta ki te ta ki te ta ki te ta ki te ta ke di mi ta ke di mi ta ke di mi ta 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 one two three one okay so I had three accents against four metronome clicks. Okay, let's do another example. Let's do five against three. So once again, the process, we're gonna start off with our five tuplet, known as conda. And then we are going to apply jati three. Two, three, four, five. So we start off with our conda, five tuplet, ta, ke, gi, na, tone. I'm gonna do that four times to set the speed, and then I'm going to replace the five syllable group with the three syllable group, ta, ki, te. And we are going to get a pattern that looks like this. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. You're going to accent every three. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three so that I will pr perform one, two, three, four, five equally spaced accents against three metronome clicks. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set the speed of the five tuplet four times, and then replace the five syllables with the three syllables. ta Ta, one, two, three, four, five, one. Okay, so thereby we achieve a five to three ratio. Let's do one more example. Let's say we want to do seven against three. So we will start off with our seven tuplet, Misra, and then we will apply our Jati three. Now remember, Jati is just another way of adding regular pulses. So I'm going to be adding 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3 seven times until we get a cycle of 7 times 3, 21. Okay, so we are going to start off with our 7 tuplet. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And I'm going to use the same syllables we used last time. Ta, ke, di, mi, ta, ki, te. And I'm gonna do that four times and replace those syllables with the three syllable group. And it's going to look like this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 
We're going to accent every three. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. One, two, three. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven accents against three metronome clicks, a seven to three ratio. So start off with our seven tuplet. Taka dimi taki to taka dimi taki to taka dimi taki to taka dimi taki to 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 ta 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 one two three four five six seven one. So that uh, that is a seven to three ratio. Now just imagine you can take any two numbers and apply this method and perform the ratio.